You may use Gmail, but do you really use it? I don't know what that means. Uh, here are 10 cool and simple tricks that you might not have known about until now. Resize compose box, pretty straightforward. When replying to messages, you can pull down on the lower right hand corner and give yourself a little more wiggle room. Drag and drop attachments, an excellent feature. No more uploading. Take the file from your desktop, and drag it into your email message, and there it goes. Did you know you basically can use Gmail without a mouse? You just need your keyboard and some keyboard shortcuts. And when I say some keyboard shortcuts, I mean many, many keyboard shortcuts. Search Google for Gmail keyboard shortcuts and you'll see that the list goes on and on and on. Your inbox is a mishmash of read and unread messages. If you'd like to see just the messages you haven't read, in the search box, type label colon unread space label colon inbox, and it'll show you just the ones you haven't read yet. If you're filling out a form on some website and you don't want to use your actual email address, just add plus something to the end of your username. So your username plus spam, plus bills, plus whatever, and then use Gmail's built-in filtering feature to filter unwanted messages right past your inbox. Synchronize tasks. Easy as falling in love. Click the tasks button, add some tasks, then from your mobile phone when you're out and about, go to gmail.com slash tasks, and there are your tasks. For these next few tricks, please go to settings, then the labs tab, then enable the following features. SMS from chat. Use Google's built-in chat feature to send text messages to other phones. Just enter the phone number, then enter the message to the caller, and they'll get a text message. Drunk? Angry? Drunk and angry? Undo send gives you up to 30 seconds to rescind the message you just sent. So maybe once you've had a little time to calm down and cool off, you can send the message you meant to send in the first place. Remember the trick from before where you can see only the unread messages in your inbox? You don't have to type that search string into the search bar every time. That's where Quick Links comes in handy. Whatever page you're on in Gmail, you can create a quick link to exactly that. And last but not least, the ultimate Gmail trick, send an archive. Reply to a message in your inbox and get it out of your inbox in one fell swoop by hitting send an archive.